and more now on our breaking news this morning. Violence followed by panic and chaos when three people are gunned down overnight in Philadelphia's Kensington section. Eyewitness News reporter Crystal Cranmore is live at the scene this morning where our cameras really did capture some pretty dramatic video of this scene. Crystal, what have you learned so far? Good morning. Well, I can tell you that family members here are very distraught. They were heard screaming in distress. Now, authorities just arrived here to scoop up the, one of the victims, the male victim who died at the scene, according to authorities. He was pronounced dead at 2.59 this morning. Medics tried to revive him, but unfortunately, they were unsuccessful. Let's get straight to that dramatic video of the scene here at D in Indiana, here in Kensington section of Philadelphia. Again, police rushed to the scene around 3 o'clock this morning. Our cameras were rolling as police scooped up one of the three victims, a female. We blurred her face for sensitivity reasons. Now, two women were rushed to the hospital, one shot in the neck, according to police, another shot in the hip, both in critical condition. Now, we did speak with Chief Inspector Scott Small, who painted a picture of the scene moments before the shooting. Here's what he had to say. Real-time crime cameras did capture the victims all standing around a red vehicle. And at one point you see one of the females actually in the red vehicle and then she exits the red vehicle and that's when the shooting occurs. So and authorities tell us that those cameras actually captured the suspect, so they're hoping that the video leads them to the, the person who did this. They are also saying that they don't know the motive at this point. They're not sure if this was sparked by some kind of argument, but we, of course, will stay on top of this story as more information becomes available. For now, we're live in Kensington. Crystal Fanmore, CBS3 Eyewitness News. All right, Crystal, thank you.